new life and new civilizations. To boldly go where no man has gone before. Welcome back everybody and uh, today we're coming to you from Murai Beach in the North Island of uh, New Zealand to bring you some uh, full driving tips. We're just going to go over now and introduce you to our driver today who will be uh, Mike Maitland from Maitland Auto Body. Most important thing uh, when you're going full driving is to have a highly experienced uh, driver and we'll just go over to Mike now and uh, say good day. Howdy. Is, uh, so how long have you been uh, driving, four-wheel -wheel driving, uh, Mike, on this beach? At least two years. Maybe more. <laughs> well, Mike used to uh, run the tours here for a couple of years, didn't you, Mike? Yeah, I think that's right. Yeah, I'm not, not exactly sure, but... <laughs> uh, Mike Maitland here used to uh, run a tour company up and down the beach for a few years, and uh, how did how'd that, how'd that go, Mike? Did you... Was it pretty good? Yeah, well, uh, since the tragedy, um, yeah, I can't really talk about it anymore. Uh, well, we'll back, back with you in a minute. Just, well, the first things first is that you need a very reliable vehicle, and uh, we're running today a 4x4 uh, four by, four by four Jeep, and uh, we're going to cross over to Mike now and uh, get some uh, tips on how to set your vehicle up for uh, riding on the sand. Okay, what we've got here is a uh, four-cylinder diesel-powered four-wheel drive Jeep. Um, quite reliable. Um, Had been known to break down, get stuck, but I think we'll be able to manage a few uh, pointers today and show you exactly what's going to going to happen out there. What's up, the brush? Are you doing it? Yep. Are you filming? Yep. Are you doing it? Did say start yet? Yeah. Are you filming? Okay, now we're going to uh, check out the tyres, and you need uh, four really good tyres with decent tread. The biggest problem with sand is that you get sand in the tyre tread, and you actually lose traction, and you can't uh, the vehicle won't drive properly. So <coughs> we're just going to check out these tyres. <sighs> yeah, these are uh, I've known these tyres for years. They're the best tyre you can get on the market. They are a uh, twenty-three-five. Uh, 15. Really good tyre, decent tread. The only trouble is you get sand stuck in them like this, so it's always handy to bring a brush. This way you can get keep the sand out of the tyre and you'll get a lot better traction. <coughs> Doesn't take that long to get around the tyre to do it, but uh, yeah, we'll check back in a minute and see how I'm doing. The other thing is, uh, once you've cleaned the <coughs> sand out of the tyre treads, you want to go through the go through the train that you're actually going to uh, be driving through and make sure there's no twigs or anything that could give you a possible puncture. So a good idea, with, again, is to uh, come along with a brush, just like this. Just clear a path along, along where you think you're going to be driving. <coughs> that way you can brush out any twigs or, or shells or something that may you know, possibly give you a puncture and, you know, Really stuff your day up. Just gonna go along here and see if we find any twigs. So what we're gonna do now is we're just gonna probably heading the vehicle in this direction here. So all we're gonna do is go along and just clear ourselves a little path. There's no 
twigs or uh, shells or anything. Uh, look at that prime example. That that could possibly have given us a spare puncher, right? Right through there. And uh, that could be really bad. So just as well we brought the brush to check the uh, terrain out. Once we got the uh, track marked out where we are going to go, uh, we can get back in the vehicle and uh, go for a bit of a run. Room's also good for the interior. Yeah, sometimes when you're driving along and the, uh, you come along the terrain gets really soft, you get some really deep soft sand. You may need another couple of horses, and here they are. Hey, come back! Come back! Well, if you can't get a couple of horses, you just have to use the old-fashioned way. Also very important when you're out on the beach having fun for the day is to be aware of all safety things and that includes wearing your seatbelt, no drinking and driving and in no littering. So if you take any littering, take it out with you and you'll have a great day. Yep, real tidy in there. 
Come to the kitchen. There's our three maids, <laughs> Vanessa, Mandy, yeah, and Paula. That's her there.
Lekker waard. Lekker waard. Ja, ja, wel heel lekker. Wel heel lekker. Dedication on his mind. Yeah. Find your jelly tip. Eh? Find your jelly oh, tip. No, Thank you.